Three, two, one, go! Qualification match number 65. We have a cone scored and good from 14.525, the Terabytes. They've already scored another cone. Terab Terabats, your current first ranked team, and they are showing why, trying to continue scoring up high, but look to have knocked over some of their cones. The Blue Alliance can take advantage of that missed autonomous 11 0 47 with two high junction scores. And Robocorns also Pick putting up, up some high autonomous Three, points for your two, Blue Alliance. One. Coming out of autonomous, a lead towards your Blue Alliance thanks to those scores from the Robocorns and screw it. Robocorns once again coming up to high to score. It is good. 16 4 4 1 now with the cone in hand. Their intake is able to rotate, it looks like a full 180 degrees back and forth, which means they don't actually need to turn their drivetrain to score. So they're able to move back and forth between the stack of cones on their side of the field and the high junction very efficiently and hopefully reduce the margin of the lead for blue, reducing that for their red alliance. Their alliance partners 14-5-2-5, looking to come around the field and grab another cone. But, but the Blue Alliance is not slowing down. Blue Alliance taking ownership of a lot of these junctions across the field, potentially over half the junctions. 11-0-47 now taking ownership again of a mid-junction, but Terabyte Bats taking that right back. Robocorns now with a cone in hand. Their intake swiveling back and forth, but they are able to score successfully. We are now in endgame. Blue Alliance already has over 200 points. We'll see if either Alliance can make a circuit in these last few seconds as they take beacons to secure ownership. Robocorns doing exactly that with their beacon, looking to place it. It's good, it goes back and forth, but holds on. Terabats with their beacon, it's good. With four, three, two, and one. Both Blue Alliance robots able to park in their Blue Alliance wins 279 to 154.